So yesterday I'm flipping channels and I stumble across the Lifetime uh, show about where is Wendy Williams. And first of all, let me say, I'm a huge Wendy Williams fan. I love Wendy Williams. I was on her show numerous times. Wendy treated me great. Um, our shows basically started at the same time. I was a big fan of her show, so I'm, I'm all in Wendy Williams' corner. But when I watched last night on that show, it disturbs me because I doesn't think it does any good for Wendy. It doesn't make her look good. She obviously has big time struggles, medical conditions, and addiction. And what they're showing is somebody is not protecting her. Um, it doesn't put her in a good light. I don't see how this serves any purpose at all. Um, she should, one, uh, her manager talking about, is she ready to do a podcast? She's ready. She's been doing this for 20 years. She's no position to do anything, interviewing. She, she should not be interviewing anybody. So before you start talking about putting her back out in the public, you should be getting her help, making sure she recovers fully and that she's able to do it. Because I got to tell you, I was disturbed and I'm saddened by, I feel people uh, using her. Um, they're, not, they're not protecting her. And I hope that somebody close to Wendy says, hey, we shouldn't be doing this. We got to get her help and put an end to this nonsense. So... Well, I'll pray uh, yo, for you, so Wendy. today we're actually about to speak about something else, something very serious and dire. And I have been running away actually from this topic and trying to find my words, trying to find a proper way to approach this and the proper way to actually um, report on this, right? Um, I do not need, we can just get that out of the way. I do not need to talk about this. Nobody's forcing me to talk about this and nobody is, you know, um, asking me or waiting for me to give my opinion on this situation. So we are going to talk about radio TV host um, Wendy Williams. Wendy Williams, radio TV host from back then. I don't know, maybe in the 90s, 2000s, you know, did a lot of, she started radio and then she went on, went on, went on, went on, and then she ended up having her own show. Y'all know her. She's big on the gossip, you know, like she paved the way for a lot, a lot of gossip channels, a lot of, you know, these channels, like, yeah, she paved a lot and it would behoove of me to actually, you know, give my respect to you know she's an OG to me because then I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing right now. If it weren't for people like her, that sit the precinct, the sit, you know, the, the stage, I would say for us, um, gossip channels news channels to exist right so let's put that out of the way so now um she's going through something she's going through dementia uh she has been reported sick and it has been the worst ever right cool being sick is normal right that's okay she's getting right the treatment she you know needs and all of that but now the, then the news comes in or the my problem comes in and i'm gonna be very fast about this because i really don't want us to stay on this for a while um then it was reported that her biography is uh biography biography for y'all biography you know uh biography is dropping and it's just about her life like you know like her lifetime almost like a lifetime type of uh thingy and it's looking bad people it's really looking bad and it's just wow right and with the condition that she is in right now, like if you guys could see the condition that she's in, she's in I'm gonna try to like clip in a few clips if they're gonna allow me, you, know, you get me? Like if they're gonna allow me, I'm gonna try and add in a few clips. And I am not gonna lie to you, like I don't think she's in a position to um, be doing all of this. And I don't, I don't think the moral thing to do is post this and then and, and monetize off this and, and, and you know, this is not a good time. And I know there's going to be people sitting there thinking, um, but she never gave a fuck, you know, she never gave a fuck uh, about other people when they were sick and, and she just cared about her job. And I know there's people who also have to do their jobs, but 
two negatives don't really, you know, make a pass. Actually, they do. Ah, fuck. You know, in maths, they do. So does this add up? Never mind. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's no time. But let's not. What I'm saying is that I get it. It's the, it's the, it's the industry. But can somebody not stoop low? Can somebody, like, speak out about this? Like, I'm so glad this guy is speaking out. Steve is, is speaking about this. And a lot of people, Joe Budden podcast was also speaking about it. And I'm so glad, like, especially, you know, and I'm going to be very biased right here. Like, especially my black queens, you know what I mean? Like, if it's, especially my black queens, I need my black queens to, to be protected a, a, a bit more than the average, you know, like, person, you know. And then this includes all race. A bit more. We need more protection from, you know, for, for, for black women in general, you know. And that's my bias, you know. I, I, that's me personally, you know. Um, yeah, and I, I, I do not agree with what they're doing, dropping this and exposing her in such a manner because this is this is bumming me out. It's just sad. This is very sad. I hope everybody prays for her. I hope she gets through this, and I hope she gets like the cure, and she just gets privacy. You know, I also understand people who would claim karma. Right? There's people who be like, yeah, this is the karma for all her you, you did to everyone else. But I also understand the people that would be like, hey, guys, that's not, you know what I mean? I mean, being a good person is seen from both sides, you know what I mean? Anyway, what you guys got to say about this situation, um, comment down below. Let's have a discussion. You know, nobody is right. Nobody is wrong. Get me right. Like, we can just have a conversation, maybe get to, like, the bottom of this. Subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram. I'm out, man. I love y'all. Stay safe out there, man.